can't see the heat pumps from here, but they're over on the south side of the house. Betsy Hardy has lived in this Richmond home for nearly five years. She says the house, which is over 100 years old, is now running off of clean energy, a change she feels strongly about. It's just the right thing to do, I think. I think it's a moral obligation. Officials and guests met outside of Hardy's home Tuesday to kick off the Zero Energy Now program, a comprehensive approach for homeowners and businesses to cut their energy needs and switch to renewable sources. These two are the outside units of heat pumps. That's actually where all the action happened. Contractor Chuck Reese was in charge of the overhaul on Hardy's house. She's totally off of fossil fuel, produces no carbon, that's for all her heat, domestic hot water, electrical uses, and everything. Improvements included solar panels, new heat pumps, and windows. That's a spray foam. Reese says the three-phase process started in the basement and moved up. Here in the attic, Reese added two feet of cellulose, which is ground-up newspaper here. He says between air sealing and this step is the most important step in the process. Because you're, you're eliminating the stack effect which is this draw of air that comes in the basement and out your attic. So if you do nothing else, that's what you should do. The program is sponsored by Green Mountain Power. Up to $5,000 in additional incentives are available for qualifying properties in select areas of the service territory. If we're going to be successful in trying to reach Vermont's goal of 90% renewables, we have to have much more efficiency. And that's what this program uh, is about. The goal is to complete 50 projects by the end of the year. Reese says it's something any homeowner can do. This is a 100 year old house. We're convinced that this is the path to a sustainable energy future for Vermont. This is how we're going to do it. In Richmond, Keel Smith, WPTZ News Channel 5.